Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, thank you for taking time out of your day to watch my video. I really appreciate it. Um, see, today we're going to be carving a mushroom. I know I've carved one before, but it was painted. This one's just going to be a natural one. Um, let's see, before I start that, i got a couple things I want to tell you. Uh, first thing is, we have a website. Uh, we finished it up. Uh, it's up and running, chainsawchad.com. Check it out. We're really excited about that. And we also have t-shirts and hoodies coming. Uh, they're not up on the website yet, but they're going to be coming soon. Uh, we've been trying to decide what uh, design we wanted on the front. Uh, finally, we, we just couldn't decide, so I actually drew a couple, uh, a couple of pictures. They're, they're hand drawn by me. Uh, they're at the printing place right now, uh, getting proof done and all that, all that good stuff. So they're supposed to be sending me uh, proof uh, so I can review it today or tomorrow. And then after that, uh, we pick out what shirts and what hoodies we want, and uh, yeah, we'll go from there. And hopefully, they'll be on the website pretty soon. So yeah, check that out, ChainsawChad.com. Okay, the second thing I wanted to tell you, um, if you guys have Facebook, we are doing a carving giveaway on Facebook. Uh, it's an owl. Go to Chainsaw Chads on Facebook. All you have to do is like my page, uh, share the page, and make a comment. And see, there's two weeks, and we'll draw a winner. Everything's on the Facebook page, so go check that out. It, uh, it looks like winter is here, um, ready or not, I guess. It came a little early. I hope I didn't bring down the uh, snow from the UP by moving, but uh, yeah, up in Paradise where I was from, they, uh, I heard they got about two feet. Uh, I'm glad we don't have that, so that's something good to be thankful for. Um, yeah, let's, uh, let's get started on this mushroom. It's... Uh, I just wanted to do a mushroom again. Uh, the other one was painted. This one is just going to be natural color. Um, I'm going to sand it real nice. I just want to show you guys what using different kind of wood, it, it totally changes the whole the whole look of the, the product. Um, it, 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 they turn out really cool. Um, you can see the difference, the sap, the sap wood compared to the uh, heartwood. But I'll get more into that once we get started. Um, yeah, I'm going to get my gear together and we'll get started. I almost forgot one other thing. I'm actually gonna be doing a bonus video. I'm hoping to post it on Friday. Um, just to something a little extra. Um, so make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell and that will notify you when I actually post the video because I'm not sure if it's gonna be Friday or Saturday. I'm, I'm hoping Friday so so make sure you hit the notification bell and uh, subscribe to my channel. And yeah, let's uh, let's get started on this mushroom. All right, so uh, like I said before, I've done a mushroom before, but this one's just gonna be natural color. Um, I always start with the mushroom upside down, so this will actually be the stem right here. Um, and then we'll flip it around after we get the stem made.
All right, we got the uh, stem carved. It's upside down. Um, this is white cedar. Uh, it's just a block, maybe 10 inches tall. Um, yeah, you can already see the different... Uh, cedar has a really cool grain to it and stuff. Uh, um, yeah, I'm going to unscrew it from the bottom. I just have it screwed in here. much as you want. I like I always like to leave some chainsaw marks in it just so you can tell it's a chainsaw carving. Otherwise you might as well buy something plastic. Um, yeah I'm gonna unscrew it and we'll bring it into the workshop and put a finish on it. We'll make all this uh, grain pop out and you'll be able to see the lighter and darker colors a lot better. All right we are back in the shop. Um, I also forgot I like to burn underneath a little bit so I was just working on that. All you do is take a torch and uh, run it underneath the bottom. Something like that. And then just take a, take a nylon brush, brush it in. You don't have to do that if you don't want to, but it, uh, it kind of sands it a little bit underneath where you can't get the sand, the sander. So that's what I do. All right, so we will uh, coat it with a coat of this log oil. And, uh, we'll see what the grain looks like. You can kind of see already how it uh, shows the grain really well once you put a uh, coat finish on it. And then the uh, lighter color is the sapwood, the dark color is the, the uh, heartwood. But yeah, cedar is kind of a, a really cool wood to work with. I enjoy it. Um, it's easy to carve, it's soft, it's bug proof. So yeah, if you're, uh, if you're a beginner chainsaw carver, mushrooms are uh, kind of an easier one to start with. All right, I'm just about done putting finish on here. Um, these uh, mushrooms are available on my website. Uh, they're $25 a piece plus shipping. Um, 
Yeah, they make good presents. There's also colored ones. I think we got teal, uh, let's see, magenta, and what other color? Uh, red. Those, uh, those are all painted on the top with white dots. So check those out. We also have owls. We got, uh, let's see, trees, painted trees, natural trees. Um, what else we got? Oh, feathers. A couple, two different size feathers. There's a 16 inch and a 24 inch. So yeah, check out our website. Um, I'll let you know once we get the, uh, the t-shirts and hoodies up. Um, I hope they go well. I'm really excited about them. Um, let me know, write me a comment if, uh, if, if you might be interested in a t-shirt or a hoodie. I have no idea really how many to order. Um, yeah, but uh, I really appreciate you guys taking the time out of your day to watch my video. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you will be notified when I post my, um, my bonus video. Um, it's just something new I want to try. Just a bonus video um, in the middle, probably Friday I'm hoping. So subscribe and hit the notification bell and you'll be notified once I post that video. And check out the website and what else? I guess I will see you guys hopefully Friday or Saturday. I'm hoping Friday. And thank you very much for watching.